In this video, we're gonna go over the top five problems on this BMW 3 Series. What do you think of this? It's probably one of them, right? Let's get into it. It's never a good sign when you see smoke pouring out from under the hood. So let's start with number one, the valve cover. These valve covers from the factory are plastic and that's great for weight reduction. Unfortunately, with the heating and cooling of the engine, over time, the plastic gets brittle and will crack. When it cracks, it's gonna leak the oil onto the exhaust and that's where you're gonna get your smoke. Unfortunately, you can't repair the valve cover, you're gonna have to just replace it. Luckily, there's an updated aluminum valve cover that's gonna prevent these issues because of heating and cooling. It's not gonna crack. And one has got you covered, literally. This next problem won't leave you stranded, but the last three definitely could. Number two problem is the blower motor. What you're gonna notice is no air coming out of the vents, whether you have it on heat or AC, and depending on the speed, it's not gonna matter. You're not gonna feel any airflow. On this vehicle, it's located under the glove box, under the dash, it's easy to access. Some of the older BMWs, it was located under the hood and there was a lot more involved. This, you just take a panel off, it's right there, pull it out, put a new one in, you're good to go. Now we're onto the problems that could cause you to get stuck on the side of the road. It's important that your vehicle has the appropriate amount of coolant, and if it doesn't, you can cause some serious engine damage. And that leads us to our third problem, the water pump and this coolant adapter. If you notice coolant on the ground or your coolant level's low, chances are one of these is leaking. Let's take a look at them. Right up on top, you can see where the coolant adapter is, right here. And the original one's made of plastic. Over time, just like the valve cover, it can get brittle and crack, causing a leak. This new style is aluminum, so that's gonna prevent any headaches there. Let's take a look at the water pump. You can see the water pump best from underneath the vehicle, and it is an electric water pump. You're gonna have a power connector going to it. You don't have to deal with any of the belts or anything like that, it's just right there. It's a little bit tricky to get to, but not too bad. And you can see there's a thermostat housing right next to it. The next problem that's gonna give you a bad day is the fuel pump. Luckily, it is located underneath the back seat, so it's easy to access. This can give you a stalling condition or even a no start. When you go to start the vehicle, it's just gonna crank forever and the vehicle will never catch. When your vehicle is running rough and the check engine light is flashing, it means your vehicle has a misfire. It's never a good idea to drive it. You're gonna cause other components to fail and it's gonna cost you more in the long run. That leads us to our last problem, the fuel injectors. On most vehicles, when you have a misfire, it's related to the coils or the spark plugs. That could also be the case here, but more often than not, there's a problem with the injectors. If you know which cylinder is misfiring, if you swap the injectors and the misfire moves, you know that's a bad injector. So those are our top five problems that we found with this BMW 3 Series. I hope you don't get stuck on the side of the road, but if you do, 1A Auto can help you out. And Make sure you watch those videos to help you with your installs. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe to our channel, ring the bell, turn on all notifications so you don't miss any of our videos.